I'm doing a short, unrehearsed video, unstaged, on the heating system for the Scuda. Um, there's a, a real uh, heater here. It's a muffin heater. It's a radiator with a fan behind it. Uh, and the heater hoses for it are the red lines. The black line is a propane. Those uh, lines run through here. Uh, which is a maintenance locker then they run through there and that's a drain valve which this is going to be the back of the kitchen uh, uh, cabinets area here's where the refrigerator will be mostly those two lines tie that last heater in and then this is a heater closet the boat is pretty small we don't have a lot of space for closets so we have about a, a 14 inch cl wide closet here it's about I don't know, eight or 10 inches deep. And uh, this area down here is where we're gonna put the uh, electric board. Electric panel's gonna go on the wall there, on, believe it or not, underneath the plumbing. Yeah, that's where it's going. But uh, uh, the, this is a circ pump, a service valve, uh, a summer valve, and a T above it. The bottom of the summer valve is gonna tie up to the, this, this other heater. The outlet for this heater is going to be down on the, coming out down on the floor down there. Uh, and the outlet for the other side of the heater is going to be defrost for the helmsman. It's actually going outside uh, into a covered area. Um, and then that uh, there's a back hose here that's still not hooked up. You can see right there, I gotta work, I'm going to have to work on that tomorrow. Uh, and that's going to get tied down to that. There's got to be a barb put on there. I gotta snake a hose around through there and get that one picked up. And then this is an expansion tank and that that's hooked up. There's actually an aquastat there that's a thermostat for the line. It won't run water to the pump or the won't circulate until the temperatures or actually it won't turn the fans on until the temperatures in the line is up to 120. And then up above that is a burp tank. Right here is gonna be a shower outlet. Um, but anyway, that's what I've been up to. Uh, also, I made a uh, made a piece for the front of the step here. The step that step you're looking at it's only seven inches wide. And after all the hoses are on, which includes water hoses, they're not here yet. Then we'll uh, we'll glue this in place and make the step the width it's supposed to be. And if we have to um, service those lines, we will have access to get them in and out through those voids there, but there's no reason to install that now while we're doing all the plumbing and make the plumbing harder. Um, anyway, then in the back of the back of the closet, this will be the shower. There's the water heater that is going to get tied into the boiler system. Uh, and this is the helm station, uh, which we have some just some insulation in there right now, but you can see the steering wheel is sort of mounted. Um, and uh, back in here we'll have a real tiny 11 inch uh, bowl and a, a, a faucet single post faucet and then the shower head will be here and then back in here we have just a tiny little one person uh, shower uh, so anyway in these panels here we'll close them off for access this panel here I probably will buy a starboard commercial panel uh, which has a seal on it and all that the bottom one I think I'll make uh, I'll use the cutout and I'll make a panel for that. I'll put a backer on there and just screw that panel in there with some screws and some seal uh, sealant um, because it shouldn't have to access the water heater all that much, I'm hoping. And possibly, uh, if I have to, I could make a little better access for the water heater from this side if I have to. Anyway, that's what I'm up to. Uh, it's messed in here. There's a lot going on, believe it or not, all these tools are being used for the most part. Uh, and we have a little bit of heater in here, a little radiant heater and a second heater if it gets real cold. But this one's been holding. Uh, big giant, giant shop vac for all the dirt and messes we make. Um, I'm hoping that by next Friday, I can have all the plumbing rough and done uh, and actually get all the plumbing stuff out of here. And then the panels for the there's a panel for the vanity that's going to go right here. That panel is actually getting some fairing work. And there's two panels for this that are going to get put in. 
in the bottom part of the kitchen. And then there's a panel that goes there and a panel that goes there and another bottom panel. Those are on the, uh, those are waiting to be uh, vac bagged. I haven't had a chance to do them yet. But uh, anyway, that's what's going on with the Scooter Cabin. Five minutes of a wonderful video for you guys. Bye.